let's move on to one of the most important features, routes. Here, we'll see how to create, optimize, and save routes using Badger. As you know, this is one of the biggest problems Badger solves. It allows you to plan your days on the road in the most efficient way possible. It's hard to schedule your day and plan your routes by using a map, your calendar, and your customer data all in different programs. Badger combines all these elements and allows you to plan your days around your best opportunities and to optimize your time on the road so that you can boost your sales. After filtering your accounts, you're probably seeing on the map only those accounts you're interested in. Now, it's time to create an optimized route to go ahead and visit them. The easiest way to add these pins to your route is by using the lasso tool. You'll see that there's a lasso tool and a radius in this section here. Both of them allow you to draw a line around the points you want to select. The difference is that while with the lasso, you can create a freehand line around the desired points, Radius allows you to draw distance-based circles to select the accounts you're interested in based on how far they are from a specific point on the map. Once you've selected them, click on Add to Route and the app will automatically create an optimized route to go from one point to the other. Let's go ahead and add start and end locations. I'm going to enter work and home. After doing this, we'll need to click on optimize and we can see the route on the map is now much better. We can always add new points to the route in different ways. For example, you can click on any pin on the map and select add to route on this button. You can also add leads that you find with the places tool to your route. Remember to always click optimize after adding new points to get the best route. There's also an easy way of creating routes or adding stops to your current route with route popovers, quick stops, and suggestions. Go to the add location popover here to select multiple specific accounts at once to add to your route. Click on add to route for every account you want to visit and then optimize to get the best route to drive to those accounts. You can also add temporary stops that you don't want to add to your accounts. For example, coffee shops, gas stations, or lunch spots by going to this tab and entering the address here. There's also an option to add suggested accounts to your current route on this section over here. These suggestions are based off of where you're located on the map so that you can quickly add accounts that are close to you. Now, let's say one of these is a fixed appointment that we need to be at during a specific time period. We can click on the time of the meeting and set a specific time. Let's set a start time of 1 p.m. and we'll say the length is 30 minutes. We can see that the appointment shows how late or early we will be based on the current route. If we want to adjust this, we can drag the appointment up or down in the schedule so that we end up on time or early based on the rest of the route. We can now save the route for a specific date and give it a name. You can also make adjustments later through the route popovers, and you can also load it on your iPhone or Android phone once you've saved it. There's an option here to delete the route in case you no longer need it. And on this button here, you'll find options to download the route as a PDF or GPX or even to send it to your calendar. This way, you'll get reminders on the routes you need to make every day as you can sync Badger with your calendar. You can also delete any saved route by clicking on this red X here.